Hello students, today we will talk about combination reaction. What is combination reaction? The word itself defined. When two or more reactant combine and forms single product is called combination reaction. Suppose we have A and B reactant and both they combine together and forming AB product. Such type of reaction when two reactant or more reactant forming a single product is called a combination reaction. For example, you can see calcium oxide when we add into the water calcium hydroxide is formed and heat is also evoked evolved. Such type of reaction when heat is evolved is called exothermic reaction. The exo means exit you know very well and the thermo means heat. When heat is evolved, when heat is evolved in any reaction, mein, such type of reaction will say exothermic reaction. How we will test it? How do we know? For example, the same reaction if we suppose we have a container in which we added the water, we also added calcium oxide into the water, then the same reaction will appear. This is a calcium oxide added into the water, right? After a while, when you touch this container, the surface of the container will be hot. In this way you can say it is an exothermic reaction. What is an exothermic reaction? In exothermic reaction heat is evolved or comes out. When heat is comes out such type of reaction is called exothermic reaction. So this reaction is a combination reaction as well as exothermic reaction. Clear? Now the calcium oxide also known as quick lime. Quick lime is very uh, common. Hindi we isko hum chuna bhi bol dete hain. When quick lime, yani chuni ko, jab hum pani mein dissolve karenge, to usme se heat niklegi. And when heat is comes out in any reaction, that reaction is referred exothermic reaction. So it is exothermic as well as combination reaction. This is slack lime. After adding quick lime into the water, the slack limes will be produced. This is also called lime water. This is what we call lime water. What did we do? Lime ko water in water. Lime water. Now, this slack lime is used in the white wash of wall. हम अपने घरों में जो वाइट वॉश कराते हैं वॉल का उसमें हम क्या करते हैं कैल्शियम हाइड्रोक्साइड व्हिच इज अ बेस एक्चुअली इट इज अ बेस इसको हम क्या करते हैं वाइट वॉश करते हैं व्हाट रिएक्शन विल कम्स व्हेन वी वाइट वॉश ऑन द वॉल द कैल्शियम हाइड्रोक्साइड व्हिच इज अ स्लैक लाइन आफ्टर सम टाइम्स इट रिएक्ट विद द it is start reacting with the carbon dioxide which is available in the atmosphere and forming a layer of calcium carbonate calcium carbonate a layer of calcium carbonate which is a white colored layer on the wall right because of the formation of calcium carbonate and water is also there in the form of vapor so it will go into the atmosphere i hope it is clear when quick lime add, added into the water, slack lime is formed along with the heat. Clear? So heat is produced, so it is an exothermic reaction as well as combination reaction. Another example also you can carry out from here also. When slack lime combined with the carbon dioxide, it is producing calcium carbonate along with the water vapor. Now, another example when ammonia added into Hydrochloric acid, the ammonium chloride is formed. Here also ammonia is one reactant, HCl is another reactant. 
and both combine in forming ammonium chloride. Similarly, when magnesium burn, it gives magnesium oxide. That also we have done in the class. We were burning of the magnesium ribbon, remember or not? Burning of the magnesium ribbon. When we burn the magnesium, what will happen? The dazzling flame comes out. Dazzling flame, you know. A dazzling flame comes out because of the formation of the magnesium oxide. Right? So heat is coming out. What type of reaction it is? Exothermic as well as combination reaction. Similarly, when hydrogen react with oxygen, what will come? Water will be formed. When carbon react with oxygen, carbon dioxide is formed. Pause the video, note it down carefully, understand the reactions. If you have any doubt, you are most welcome to us. Thank you. Enjoy the day.